Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Europa Universalis 4 as Prussia in an early Reich. That looked like that we were being conquered. Oh, because we are. Denmark's attacking us. Oh, no. That's an issue. Uh, it's a pretty big issue, got to be honest with you. Um, never even thought about that. But, hey, maybe I'll be attacked over there. That's fine, though. We'll get a couple more ducats a month. And a couple by me, I mean, like, technically only one ducat a year, but it's, it's fine. Diet's held. I can just basically, once I piece you out, I just build one infantry up here and just conquer all this through. No, I can send my 10k that I'm going to get at the end of this year over there to deal with that. We're losing money. Hey, go figure. Okay, you're done. Let's get you over here. They should peace out. Damn, Bohemia joined the coalition against me was not good. Oh, we've taken a loan. Great. I actually need to get out of these territories. Yep, Oldenburg has been pieced out. This is what's left of Maddenburg's army. Um, yeah, and rest would happen like that, huh? And that does tend to happen. Maddenberg's been sieged out. I can visit ducats, though. That really helps. Should we pay our one loan? What is it, four ducats a month? I think that has nothing to do with actually, like... Well, it might have some stuff to do with the actual um, fact that I just don't have troops. Alright, don't attach to me, dude. We're taking so much attrition. Let's fabricate a claim on Hessen. Let's stop building a spy network. Let's declare war, I think. It's fine. Um, we'll declare it for Hessen. We'll call Austria in because... Actually, no, I don't really need them in. Let's just declare war. We'll keep our favors with Austria. In case they do become the emperor, I'm going to need them. So... Um, put the money in the treasury. No, gain the 10 prestige. That would be pretty useful for aggressive expansion issues. Relatively soon. How many terri troops do I need here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Right? 7. Okay, Bonin's also declared war on Ulm. That's fine for me, Bonin. Just don't take my territories. How many troops do I have here? 4, 5, 6, 7... Come over here. Okay. Seven. I should use the uh, better mods, but it's fine. Let's get these seven out and uh, unseeding this crap. Hey, you have a pretty big uh, civil war going on, huh? Or not civil war, but very big rebels that are you're gonna have to deal with peasant rebels as well as noble rebels very nice good for me not so good for you not so good for austria either who's allied to you all right let's move in here saxony don't go too far man you might be our saxon army stack that we're eventually gonna have okay ulm probably has like no troops i want hesse and frankfurt in this war for sure like, these two provinces need to come to me. If I have to take mains, which actually would not be a bad idea, because that gives us a little bit more access. Uh, Ansbach would also be really good, but that causes a coalition, pretty big coalition again. And I really don't want them to go up that high. Mainz is already pushing it, so I might not take it. But at least Frankfurt needs to come with us, so we can start fabricating on Trier. Maybe take Nassau in one war, Wurzburg on another. Morrisburg, who's still part of my damn coalition, but will not peace out. Um, I need to take you, so taking you would actually be very good. Because I really don't care about Lubeck. I think we can handle him now. Okay. Um, you all over here. You as well. Once you're done, we'll move you again. Riga is going to be an issue for us. 
They're allied to Lithuania, but I can always break their alliance with Lithuania in a war. We're making gains. That's the good news. We're also making ducats again. Now that we're no longer being sieged. And very good provinces are being taken over. Annexation is almost done, which is very, very good for us. Um, let's get these 7k together and send them over with the rest of the troops. Down there. We have no manpower, but we are over force limit anyway. And I have room for one boat. So let's build a boat. It's another car of all, but it's fine. Um, I can build stuff to help out. Um, regimental force camps would be pretty good. So would these. Integration, of course, is a slow progress. Thank you. So now that we've gotten rid of Saxony, we got to do a couple things. Um, first things, though. Yeah, let's look to see if they have anything really interesting to build. Survey says no, so I think we'll hold on to those. We will destroy all three forts that they have. Hanholt, Sashinin, and Thuringen. Um, we need to look at state map modes. So you're the state of northern Germany. You've already been created. Um, you are the state of... Are you in northern Germany? Really? Southern Saxony we can create pretty easy. Let's create you. Um, Cassell? No. No. Thuringia. Okay, sure. And now let's core. Are all promises here? No promises can be cored. What? Already our cores. Okay. So you just 60%, but are you going to go down to zero? Yes, you are. Good. So we got the incorporate vassal, conquer Celestia, which is over here, isn't it? Wait, where is that? Celestia. What? Karunas is over here, I think. Celestia. Oh, no, it's an area. That's right. Canuas, though, is not. It's up there. Um, I'd rather do Celestia, honestly. I just need Breslau. That gives us a permanent claim on it. Um, we could add on policy, which is more discipline. Not a bad policy to get, but I don't want to spend admin right now. We'll wait. Um, let's continue building a spy network on you. I don't think I ever got done building it. I need to wait for the coalition to disband, though. That's going to be an issue. You need to leave the coalition. Like That's a guarantee. Annex a member of the Holy Roman Empire. Well, we're now accepting Saxon, which is very nice. Should increase our trade power in Saxony itself by a good amount. States demand territory. Of course they do. All right. Hey, clergy. Um, it's why. Do you want a good base tax? This can go to the nobility. Because I think they demand territory as well. Yeah, they do. All right. Go to the nobility. Oh, you should have gone to the nobility. Seven? Yeah. Oh, wow. That's a lot. No. Sashin should have gone to the nobility. If I send you now, uh, yeah, we'll send it now then. You can go to the clergy. Okay. So, the nobility just got a shit ton of power, but it's fine. They don't have a decrease, right? And I can always pull it back if I need to. Granted, generalship's actually the only thing increasing it. That's fine. Okay. You're not a siege leader. But I can send four cannons over here. No, you don't understand. Damn it. Okay, get in there. Come on, drop your cannons. All right. Spanish La Plata. Really, Spain. Memmingen just left the coalition, making the coalition a little bit weaker. Why did you leave the coalition, Memmingen? You have no cost against me. 
That's worthwhile to know. Monster. Palinate. You mean the Emperor was in the coalition against me? Yeah, that could have been really bad. As the coalition gets weaker, people will keep continuing to drop out, which is very good for us. It might be worth attacking the coalition if it's just them, which it very well could be. Um, Denmark's been annexed. Thank you, Sweden. I really didn't do much, but I appreciate it. Oh, actually, I did. I did against these guys. So, yeah, you're welcome. All right, I just want these two provinces. 28 war score. It's like a significant amount, but granted, general just went away. Um, let's see what we get. I'm going to request another one. It's fine. I'm not going to call it D yet, though. That much is for sure. Um, it's siege leader, hey. Let's pull everyone over except for our one guy. Send him over here. Let's combine you all. Drop the cannons. For sure the cavalry can get out of here. And you all can join. And then I'm going to take half of the infantry out. And then we'll shift, reconsolidate, shuffle and everything. I know I'm sieging, or I'm getting that from my own territory, but it's fine. All right, let's get two territories we need. Not yet, though, apparently. You go there. You come here. You barely have enough on your front line. I'm assuming Ulm's getting sieged out by Baden, which makes sense. Oh, we've lost our claims on you. That's fine. Sweden getting stronger might have actually been what caused that. You can form Scandinavia, Sweden. Ulm has accepted an offer from Bohemia. Screw you, man. Ravensburg and Mainz. I should probably weaken Bohemia if I can. When they send troops over. But... Not going to worry too much about it right now. And I will need to worry about it, but right now, not too much. Alright. You can still call Austria and now Sweden in. Don't really want to do that, so we're good. Our diplomat just died. Well, that's fine. Didn't really need him anyway. We need one more month. Although, I want a diplomat, not a statesman. Um, can I pick up a level 2 diplomat? I mean, that's level 3, but it's half cheaper, so it's not bad. Let's just pick up the level 1, I guess. That's fine. Damn, if Sigmund isn't living forever. Well, helps out on the tech, right? I get that minus tech, 5 tech because he's alive right now. Which is pretty good. Damn, I need more points for Diplo. It's going to cost me Diplo to do this, but... You can also get the burgers to give us Diplo points, but it's fine. Okay. Hello. Let's go find their army. Shouldn't be that bad. Where are you going? Coming over here. We go to Castel. Let's get the army together for the first. So you're going to get out of there before I get there. Oh, because you're, you're not coming down to me. You're going north. Okay, where are you going? I just want to fight you. Come on. Bohemia, you thought that this was a good idea, huh? You thought lending your troops out was going to be successful for you. Let me show you what happens when you decide to send troops over to a nation. Yeah, about that. Why did you have that... God, that's so stupid. Let's get out of here. Alright. That was retarded of them to do it that way. Omer currently military strength. They do hold Ohm, but I can't get to Ohm. That's fine. The war score is going to go up. Relations with Hamburg are max. Um, let's... Can I send you ducats? 
had to send a hundred. Let's see if that actually gets them out on recall. I think it will, but you never know. Is there they should drop out, I'd say, almost immediately. And if that's the case, I might attack them directly. Like, right now. Even though I have no freaking manpower. Um, although we are getting manpower pretty heavily. We're making 450 a month. We're actually making a decent chunk of manpower every month now. Uh, I can't, don't want to build another light, but it wouldn't be a bad idea. Alright, against you... Make sure we fabricate a claim on Brandberg because we want to get down in there. You have a good province, like a gold? You do. Urzer. Egger. Egger. Okay. Hey, Egger. How's our coalition looking? Uh, like it's still pretty strong. It's probably going to get stronger in a bit. I declare war on you, the Palinate defends you. Damn it. Okay. Only got more troops from them. Okay, where are you going to send them? Hmm? Where are you sending them? Keep offering them troops, I'll keep stack wiping on Bohemia. This is not good for you. Not at all. Yet you're doing this anyway. Uh, I can't get a leader because it's neutral territory, funny enough. Hey, there's the Ulm army. Warsberg, Trier, and Nuremberg have all left the coalition. I didn't even know Nuremberg was in the coalition. Verdern has also left. Cleves has left. Bremen has left. It's because I'm weakening Bohemia, probably. I just want to hear Lubeck left. Or something ridiculous like that. Where are you going? Where are you going? I will crush you. I don't. You're not holding me down with forts because he's not in the war. Like, you don't understand. If you're going all the way to Krakow... Oh, you did take Krakow. Okay. If you're going all the way to Krakow, I got bad news for you, son. I will chase you down. And I will kill you. There's nothing you can do about that. Alright, Ulm. I know you hold your capital. Just give me those two freaking territories. No? Okay. Lubeck has left the coalition. Hey, that's exactly what I wanted. Alright. You know what? I'm tired of you. And I'm going to destroy freaking Bohemia, too. Please, for the love of God, send me seven more troops to Prague. Okay. If Bohemia wants to play this game, Bohemia, we will play this game. You're only allied to them. You're also the only one in the coalition. I think it's high time. To possibly attack. Let's pull out troops here. They have no army right now. Oh, Rise of a Pretender. Shoot. Should have waited for that. 304. Well, military points will be nice. Where'd you come up? Over there. <sighs> okay, Austria wants a marriage. That's fine. Scotland, I should get a marriage with immediately. Even though... Oh, we already have. Okay. It's improved relations with Scotland. That'd be good. Yeah, Prussia and Sweden. Uh, I don't particularly like that. Um, alright, well, let's get our troops out. Over here, preferably. Okay. Go. Um, the Popery Act. Yeah, a little bit stronger strength, doesn't hurt. A little bit stronger. Alright, Ulm. This will piss off, really, only Bohemia and Lubeck. Let's do this. You. Let's get you and increase autonomy. Increase autonomy and you as well. I saw that there was a courthouse here, by the way. Don't think I didn't see that. That's an interesting choice, but it's fine. Hessen, is this part of a state? It is a state, and it is one I have. Territory of Hesse. So I could easily core this, but I gotta wait now. Okay. Let's take care of our vassal rebels, whatever. Um, embrace the reputation, lose stability. Not nah, embrace the reputation. I'm not going to take admin point or er, diplo point. Actually, 
I should have done admin. Because we're ahead of time. No. Fuck off, Palinate. You know, noble of their house seeds is thrown. They might actually succeed to that. Maria Teresa von Hansberg. Let's boost ability a bit. And I'm willing to boost it again. We're ahead of time pretty significantly still. And other than coring, I'm not really spending anything, so. Right. Other than, you know, a little thing called getting our nation back in order. Not really spending much. Seven ducats, man. Oh, you know what? I still have a fort. That's costing me. And Berlin is still not mothballed. How are you doing, Bohemia? You have 19 troops. Let's wait till I get my other 20 down. Um, okay. And then I want to shift consolidate you all, I think. Uh, actually, you're evenly matched. So let's send you over here. I can put you two here, and that would help. Hell, I might even be able to move into Prague if I move you back a little bit. If I move you up here, I could probably march straight to Prague. So let's move you back. Hey, we got an heiress at 333. He's Frederick Wilhelm. That's fine. He's not a good, good heir, but he's good enough. Eventual unrest is Hesse and Frankfurt. That is fine. We knew the unrest would be coming. Iraq has declared war in Hesse. This is a very interesting world. Let's go look around the world real quick. i got a little bit of time to kill. Uh, no guy, the Timurids still exist and are pretty damn strong. But Iraq has taken over uh, Kara. The Mamluks are still there, although the Ottomans have finally started moving. Tunis has gotten pretty big. Um, Colony-wise, no one's really expanded. And no, the zoo here in uh, Mexico have actually moved. France is not doing much. Sweden's actually colonizing. Okay. In the meantime, we're just trying to get Germany. You know, we're working our damnedest over here. Okay. How's Bohemia's army looking? 19k? 20k now. They're still getting manpower and I don't have any. But if I attack you right now, you're only allied to one province minor. So I'm not really worried about that. You're in a coalition that only involves you. And I can call Sweden in, so let's do that. And we're going to do this for Egger. So let's, uh, Egger is, of course, a fort, which I did not even think about thinking. Let's move straight to Prague. That's probably where they're at. Uh, this could go very badly for us, by the way. I fully understand that, but it's okay. Three shock, one maneuver, and no fire. Do I want to move someone else? No. Do I want to attempt to get a general? Um, the nobility have already given me one, so I can't use that to my favor. We have 60. Let's hire a general. A 2-2-3. Two, two, That's pretty good. That's better than what I have, so... Let's throw him in charge. Start him marching. Prague is farmland, so that's fine. 20k. I have... They have how many in the front line? 3 cavalry, 13 infantry. So they have 16 in the front line against my 20, so I completely outflank them. And I have one more cannon than they do, so I should just annihilate them. And they didn't have morale, apparently. That's pretty damn good. Assuming you're moving to Krakow, and I can't move there. But I am on your capital, so that's fine. And I've called Sweden in because we have so many fucking favors with Sweden. Look at this. 34, even after spending 10 to call them in. I did call them in, right? Yeah, I did. The Emperor is going to be a pain, though, for me. He's going to stay like that for a while. Overextended. Well, I mean, I did take Frankfurt and Hessen in this war, and I plan to take at least this and this, this war. I might actually gain two more provinces, or one more province here at least, would be good. Cut them off completely and get more claims on this land. One more here, I can get Rabator. Actually, I do need to take that, don't I? Because I have a mission. Yes, so conquer Celestia. I need to do that. So what's my what, what are my goals here? Well, I plan to take... Breslau, I plan to take Bramberg, and I plan to take Egger. Which pisses off everyone. But if I wait two years, which should be pretty easy, Bavaria, 56. Um, hang on. What if I don't take Egger? I probably could get away with it. 56 points, you're losing 
2.3. I'd have to wait three years. Oh, we could probably do that pretty easy. Let's siege them out to 100%. Let's see what we can do with them. I could also humiliate them, and that'd be good for me, because I can get an extra one point a month for everything for a couple months. Yeah, let's do this. Let's be at war for an extremely long period of time. Here comes the Bohemian troops, 36k. They're going to be an issue for me, I'm not going to lie, because I don't have any manpower, so... The Swiss are going to have, or the Swedes are going to have to help out quite a bit. Still no religious wars, which right now against the Palinate would be very good, because they're not really allied to anyone. Okay, uh, you're going to have to be careful, dude. They are heading your way. And I'm not going to be able to engage easily. But they might be so weak that you should be able to handle them, even with lower numbers. That does appear to be the case, at least. Get those 11 more troops in. Guarantee your victory. Because right now you're holding your own and you're outnumbered pretty heavily. So yeah, that should be a win for you. I don't care if you take over provinces right now. Okay. And now they're on the defensive. They are in grasslands, though. Hang on, guys. Hit them hard. Hit them harder. Come on. Nah, they're going to lose that battle, I think. We've taken Prague, though. We can move to Krakow. No, I can't. Damn it. Why not? Mavoria is protecting them. Damn it. Get over here. Let's get some little province kills. Or little guys kills. They might actually win this battle after all. Which is hilarious, because they sure they should not. If they win it, great. If not, I'm not going to worry about it. But I am going to go ahead and engage. In case they do win. Or not win, but... Surprised I can't call Austria into this war, but I guess they don't want to join. Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? Let's put it this way. Egger has been sieged out. That is the war goal, so that's pretty good. Um, hmm. Do I want to do that, or do I just want to peace out pretty quickly? No, I do want to wait. Funny enough. You have military access? You're guaranteeing Bavaria. That's fine. Could have you return your course to Poland, which would be good. Could have you give up claims in my territory, which also would be good, but let's not worry too much. We'll do a bit of sieging when we have time, or while we have time. Trying to catch up to this guy who has the same amount of maneuver. It's hilarious. Okay, let's shift consolidate a bit. He might be giving his troops time to catch up, which he probably was, but... We're going to kill him pretty heavily. We outnumber them with morale. Our morale is so high compared to theirs. Just in general. Let's move in. Goddamn freaking zone of control shit. Let's get out of there before they attack us with 26k. Um, they might be moving this way, so that's November 4th. Yeah, they're trying to slow us down. They're going to succeed, unfortunately. Yeah. Can I force march? No. Admin level 15. We're going to win this battle, funny enough, which is actually pretty funny when you think about it. Again, this is another battle where we don't really have a goal to win, but our discipline is so high, our morale is so much higher, our tactics are higher, um, mainly because of our discipline. That, uh... You're gonna go stack wipe them, it looks like, which is good. Where are you moving? Heading down to Switzerland? You're not heading to Prague, for sure. Really? You, are you heading there? Because I will stack wipe you if that's the case. It does not matter. Just you. Well, you did get a morale tick, so maybe it does matter. But I would do a lot of damage to you if that's the case. That is the case. Holy shit, this is going to hurt you. And a little stack wipes, even if it's only two, prom two people. This might not kill, but this is going to do a lot of damage. Yeah, that was pretty substantial. And now you're moving back all the way over there. And I gotta engage here. Um, alright. No, that can't work.
there. You come here. Frankfurt is now part of our thing. We've engaged them in Prague. Thank you for Breslau. Okay. Keep moving around. Cause them a little bit more issues. If I can cause rebels, I will. Uh, peace. If I can get this peace. But I'm still going to have a pretty massive coalition. If I don't take this, which is their gold province, no one really cares. I can use this time that we're at peace, which will be seven years, to get a little bit higher. I can break their guarantee here, or I can cancel their alliance with them. I'd rather not. And I don't want to return course. I mean, I could have you cancel your course, which would give us a little bit more prestige. Um can also have you give up all your claims. I could humiliate you, but then that puts a peace treaty for 12 years. Now let's just do this. Let's grab these two provinces. Neither one is really needed, but it helps us out. It splits them in half. Get our monthly autonomy change to go down. Let's get everyone to Berlin. Let's improve autonomy. Do this. Same thing here. Increase. Do that. And now... We immediately start working on Nuremberg. Because we want to be at war. Okay. Still a succession war between me and Sweden. And I would hope Sweden would just give it to me, but I doubt they will. Um, we can do a new mission. Rival of our rival. Free Diplo points. Just get Burgundy to like us. Sure. That should be possible. Otherwise, I wouldn't think they'd give it to us, but... Hey, guess what? It's not possible. However, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Next episode, we will, you know, finish annexing and uh, start moving on to bigger and better lands that we do need. Like this, 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 and then eventually this. And I think we're done. Because I own... I need Hamburg and Rostock still, but I can worry about that in time. That could be the last war we do. Cologne's up there, which I don't have. Palops is over here, which actually doesn't mean I have to attack the Emperor. I didn't even think about that. Nuremberg, I'm on my way to getting next war, basically, as soon as I feel like it. Um, let's get our troops together real quick, and then we'll shift consolidate. Well, first we'll shift consolidate, then we'll split in half. That way these guys can repair a bit. We will be at peace for hopefully a while. But thank you very much for watching. Next episode, we're going to be at peace dealing with rebels. Because, of course, why not? Gearing up for our last set of wars to get us very well on the track to Germany. Uh, Urs is really the one I want. but Let's claim it. It's the worst thing that can happen, right? Let's come back from Bohemia, just so I can remember to do that. And thank you very much for watching. Next episode, we'll continue on with our war. Thank you, and goodbye.